Hello everyone and welcome back to another video and today in this video we're going to be playing Lumber um, as, well, I guess week 3 of my game, of how many of times I choose a game, whatever. Um, so today we are actually going to be playing with my friend Trimpire, so yeah. Hello. Hello. Okay, so... What are we gonna do today? Um. Well, well I'm pretty I'm... sure the coal that we have have put in the um. I'm gonna go check up on the coal real quick. It's got 30 minutes left. Okay, I just want to see what it's looking hot, like. It won't be. It'll be red hot, but if we take it out now, it'll only last 12 hours. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Which the coal. If you put the coal in for an hour, um, it apparently then goes in for um, 24 hours. Yeah. So that's tech. Yeah. But then the um, but then the short amount of time you put, you have it in there. The um, the less amount of time. And by the way, that's not 24 hours time that you're in the game. That's 24 hours time that go by in the world. So. So no, like, the twenty four hours includes your sleeping. If you do, if you do sleep, I sleep. Well, the way the way it works is it's only it only stays burning until after you leave. I think. Uh, where is so like, it? If, if you were to stay on the server for twenty four hours, it would stay burning. It would. Yeah. Hmm. I didn't know that. Where did you put the coal? Uh, I will go and find it. Because I don't see it anywhere. It better still be there. Oh, no. What? I reloaded. Uh -oh. So I could get the wood from flame. Why didn't you just put it through a sawmill? Oh god. Well, there goes his only coal. Oh my yeah. god. Look at my screen share. No way that ne caught on camera. <laughs> how, how did how did that even happen? I don't know. I just landed there on top of a tree. Tree landing. Dang it. Um, I'm going to ask Aiden some. Oh my god. I didn't know I have so much. And I. And it, I totally got it back. I totally got the truck flipped back. That's awesome. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Aww. Ooh. I, just told, uh, I just told Aiden that I need more coal. Aiden's gonna be like, oh my god. Uh. Okay, large floor. Oh no, no, I'm just as poor as you are. You are? Oh. Oh, you're not, you're just a little bit richer than me, but not a huge, oh my <laughs> god, what? I landed! What just happened? I think your, your, your truck just used seismic toss on mine. <laughs> Pretty sure that's what just happened. Okay then, well, that happened, I guess. Over to here. Uh, last week of June, I guess. It's last week, full week of June. 
can't believe the year has gone by this fast. It's been an awful year. Hmm. You know, I it's feel it feels like it's been going on so slow, but it really it, but it also feels like it's been going on so fast. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I just flipped you, and I'm going to do the honors no, you keep of, keeping, of keeping you. Why is it, like, shaking back and forth? Do you see that? Yeah, I see that. I see that very much. Um, so what are you going to try and do about this? About this situation that you're inside of? Oh, my God! Apparently that. And it landed. It landed, babe. I just broke the mouse. Uh, did I get the? I just broke the mouse. Wow. I broke the. I broke the door to. The, never mind. I just dismant. I just. I just took for some reason the mouse smashed and then it took the, the, um, the door to the battery cage just gave out in life. Battery cage. Why does yeah, it sound like a really good wrestling match or something? <laughs> it's yeah. where the battery sets in the mouse. If because I have wireless mouse. A battery cage. I've never heard that before. It's basically the term where um the battery is. The battery sets. Nice fade. Okay. When do you next run? Four. Is there anything you need in links? Uh, I think I'll be good. Yeah, I'm gonna go grab a whole bunch of clock timers. Because I think I'm gonna begin actually working on my clock right now. Actually, grab me a clock. Because I kind of want to set one up in my house. Just to be a regular clock. Okay. It yeah, it, it kind of looks a little weird, though, with the whole stuff, but... Yeah, I could grab you one. My plan is to have a clock that shows digits. Um, like, more like, about, dis like, a, words, they come to me. Um, like a sort of thing where... It'll show the hour. It can't show the minute because that'd be incredibly hard to do. And then I'll have a p AM PM sign. I think what I'm gonna get start working on right now is I think I'm gonna start working on the one for like eleven and twelve o'clock. And I'm gonna get that set up. So my plan for that is I'm going to have a poking out area for from the mo from the wall. So I'm going to start I'm probably going to start it like above the TML logo cuz um Trimpire made a if you guys don't know Trimpire made me like a pixel art type thing. I can probably get it up on screen. Actually, I don't really edit, so yeah. Um, besides, like, editing through here. Like, OBS and stuff. Like, automatic things coming on the screen and stuff. Whatever. When are you next? Oh, God. Please chat end. Nice. Oh, God. Okay, the fairy just left without me being in my seat. I wish they, um, I wish Defaultio did it so the fairy didn't leave when you weren't seated. Because it says remain seated, and I'm pretty sure Defaultio knows that you glitch when you're not seated, so. That'd be nice, but, eh. <laughs> You really need to get your base organized at some point. 
Yeah, I agree. But, you know, I just really feel like I have other projects that I would like to do before I get that done. Like what, the clock? Yeah, the clock I'd like to do. I'd like to actually finish the wall. Gosh, I am starved. Like, I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. And I don't want to really go and fix something to eat. I have supper. Two hours? Oh, okay. How would I... Yeah, I know how to get. Yeah, so one, so the one for like the ten, eleven, the ten, eleven, twelve, um, like that one on a clock, like when you're looking at a seven segment display clock, because that's what the whole idea of it's gonna be a seven segment display, um, a clock with a segment, seven segment display. There's like that extra like two lines. Like an extra line, two extra segments for like 10, 11, 12. That's what I'm making today. And I'm probably going to work on the the 12th, the part on getting it like working and stuff. It's going to be a lot easier to do. But I still have to calculate like what each, yeah, it's a whole thing. I have to calculate. What, what each? Color are you, or what color are you using for the lit up segments? I'm probably gonna use just white wire, normal white. Um, if I were you, I would use green because not only do most clocks, uh, that use seven segment display are either red or green, but green is your favorite color. Yeah, that's a good idea, and then it also matches the TML 101. So yeah, I'll do green. And then obviously it's off state is black. Yeah. I might put like a backboard on it, like making it black background, so when it's off it looks invisible. But I don't know. I still don't exactly know what I'm gonna do for my shop here. Um I might make the roof just palm. Hmm. It's, because yeah. I have, I mean, I had the idea with the paintings, but it doesn't line up properly, so. Yeah. I could try I... one of my ideas. I don't know how well that will look. Yeah, and the, um, I like that idea of having the palm, but, um, yeah. Also, because the shop's so big, I would, like, every now and then put a sky roof in, so then you don't have so much, you don't have to spend a lot of time and money on, and, yeah, mostly time on getting all of the, on getting, um, on lighting everything up with, like, white wire and stuff. Please, links logic open. Thank you. Um, also with your clock, I think it would be wise to put it on the front of your base next to the Yeah, I'm planning to put it, like, right, um, like, right near the... I'm planning to put it, like, right above the TML 101 sign with like a little gap between um so yeah that's my plan for it so oh god yeah what have i done i opened up youtube no no what? captain sparkle stop oh god Something must have happened. On my phone. Ugh. Let me go get some, some background music for the viewers. For you guys. Yeah, but you guys don't see me trying to get this.
Yes, it's the live stream music that I just can't find any good music. That I just can't find any more music. Whatever, I'll use a different one. This is the song that we left off on the live stream. Okay. Even though I... Oh my god! Look at my screen share, Trump. Just a second. I am powerful. That is very powerful. And when also they all respawn, cool. I just knocked them down. Wait, how are you even able to... How were you able to grab wires through the... I don't know, it just let me. It just lets me look through that type of glass, I Wait, guess. am I just now realizing that you have to press E on the cash register to talk to the person? Yeah. Are you kidding me? I don't see a problem. I've played that. this game for years, and I didn't even think to look at the cash register when I'm trying to talk to them. Oh! Oof. I've known that from the start, because I actually, like, read the things. I'm gonna be able to have. I'm gonna. I'm gonna first set up. So here's my plan for today. Um, this lumber tycoon two week is just gonna be building my clock. So here's my plan for today. Um, my plan is to get the actual um, not wiring, but um, getting the green wires up the way I'll like them. And then like having all the materials and stuff. And then once I'm done with that, um, I might, I'm probably not gonna have all the materials. I'm just gonna set everything here up. I'm gonna set like the, the segments and stuff. I'm probably gonna set the, yeah. I'm just gonna have the, tw um, I'm just gonna have, let's just say it's 12 o'clock um, PM in lumber. Um, then I'll have 12p in, um, because there's, I don't, I feel like there's no need to put zero zero all the time. Keep it always on zero zero because, like, that's just waste of wire in my opinion. Do you agree with me, Trump? That's yeah. sort of a waste of wire doing, um, zero zero. When it's always gonna be like that. Cause oh my, cause I don't even think it's possible to keep it at a zero zero. Unless you like set it so like that's like you set it like a stopwatch since the time that you joined. That would be actually a really cool circuit to build. Just set up like a stopwatch from the time that you joined to um to that t to the current time that you're in so if you've been in the server for a billion years nobody's alive for that long but let's just say you were in the server for a billion years um that counter would be at a billion yeah that would be kind of, and then and but then when you join the server it would be at a it would be at zero I'd probably keep at keep the timer at like um, only to the hour time, but that would create like that would be very hard to do, and and it'd be like for the time that you loaded in that base because I don't think even if you can make it reset when your base loads in, I don't think you can make it start when you load the server up, unless like Defaultio releases like a new item. That like starts counting up when it gets a signal. And then it always will reset whenever. Yeah. Um. Um. So. Yeah. I think I'm going to just go grab the. Um. Yeah. I think I'm just. Um. I think I'm just going to grab this stuff. And. Um. Yeah. I'm gonna just Why am I just now realizing? Okay, so you know the um yeah the uh, 
the billboard in What Are Us. Yeah. There is a sticker on it that says, Really Red is the New Red. Yeah. And I don't know why, but I just now realized it's not red, it's magenta. I actually thought it was red. I did too, and I'm just now looking at it, and I'm like, why is it magenta? And I went to go check the wiki, and it's regularly magenta. Why then? It would. Why then would it say really red is the new red if it's magenta? That's the real question. I'm probably not gonna finish the clock at this time. Um, but I'm probably not gonna finish the clock this week. But hopefully the next time I go on the next week I go on lumber, it'll be all done. And hopefully my base will be a lot clean, super clean. So, I think I'm gonna set up the, I'm gonna set, oh God. The fairy literally just left. Great, so, and I just spilled everything. Um, I have to wait now for the fairy to come back. I guess I'll fast forward the video until I get, um, until I get to, well, until the fairy is just about to leave, I guess. So, yeah, I guess we'll be right back. Okay, guys, there's like less than 36 seconds or so left until the fairy leaves. We are back again. Some interesting thing ha things happened while I was while you were while I was well, while we were waiting. So yeah. Anyways, um, we're back again. Everything's Hello. ready. I'm pretty sure I need to buy a ticket. You already have a ticket, Kaka. Okay, okay. Uh, um, so when you get back and uh, finish setting up your clock, it'd be really nice to help me. Um, I could probably, yeah. Um, I'm not gonna actually be able to finish the clock today. Um, but hopefully by the end of this week, I should be able to, like, before the end of June and stuff. Uh, we're leaving now. So again, today's video is going to be just setting up the entire, the clock itself. So like getting, so like, this is sort of like, if you just want to make a good looking, okay clock, then this is what you're going to do. Um, if you just want to make something that says 12 and then AM or PM that doesn't light up or anything, just use this as a sort of tutorial um but yeah by the way this took like 30 minutes or so of time even though you've only been watching for like not even 30 probably like 40 minutes this video has been really for me recording it but you've been only watching for 23 minutes hmm. yes so huh. Hmm, yeah. Is this... <laughs> you know, I'm really excited to make this clock because it just seems like a really fun thing. A really fun, like, activity and stuff to be doing. How do these clock things work? Well, what you do is you use the clock... So, the clock timer. So, you set up a date at, in a, a time in the day and it tells you like when is day when is night type thing and then um if it's if it's within the time area if the time if the little tick the br black tick is within the white area then it the clock timer outputs a signal so if you really want to just use it as a normal clock like a fan like a analog clock then you're gonna have a red and a um, green little, um, two little red and green lines, um, on the clock. Oh, I see the way it's set up on yours. 
Yeah, see, um, looking at mine, it's like, um, if the um, thing is within, yes. so, I'm just gonna, yes. Like one, of them, one of them is off a little bit, I'm pretty sure. It's no. It's not straight on the line with the other one. It's not perfect, but, um, I'm pretty sure. No, um, it's, look, look on my screen share. I'm gonna head over here. I'm hanging over here because the viewers. Um, yeah, it's meant to. It, the, this one is meant to be off because if it wasn't, then no, I it. No, the lines. That line's crooked. This one's not. Yeah, I'm saying this line is off for a second because of the fact that if it wasn't, then um, it's the same way. If it wasn't like that. Then, th then they would both be on for like a like a little bit. Um, and I don't really want that, so that's really the reasoning. I'm just gonna. Okay, so I think what There's I'm gonna two. do. Is so I want so I want it up here, yeah. Um, so my plan is is to have a so it's gonna be hmm. So I'm gonna want a I want to stick a post here for the one. So this is where the one of the green wires is going to be. This is where like one of the things that you can customize uh, one of the really easy like the customizable parts of this. Like how are you going to set it up and stuff? So one looking here. Now I'm going to fill those posts up with well, wood elm wood because it's the wood that I am using for my wall and I need three pieces of elm wood I only need three even though for a post you need two is because I have the power if you have the power then you only need one um, the power. you can also um, actually I'm just going to throw you in I'm just going to throw these guys in um, yeah, if you also, you can also own the Super Blueprints Game Pass, which basically acts as the power for all your saves, so you don't have to get 10 million on every save, and then go out to do the power quest if you have the Super Blueprints Game Pass, which is kind of nice, so like whenever I start, like, for example, a new plot, like, well, not as an example, literally, as if I start up a new plot, I don't have to, I still can build with ease with the super blueprints. And anyway, I'm just kind of, you know, I kind of gotta say, I don't think, oh god, I hit a, I hit something. Um, you know, I don't think I'm, I don't think I'd be. I'm not very rich, though. That's the only problem. I'm not very rich. Okay. Yeah, that was kind of bad. Anyways. <clears throat> Over to here. And... Yeah. We'll do this. Do this, do this, do this. And then really a lot of it is just up to you. Like, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use posts as, like, the real thing that's going to hold, quote, hold up the wires. And then that's it. If you want to just put it onto a wall, I recommend having, like, at least a, a post-sized opening. Because if you don't, then you're going to need to go through the whole 
um you're gonna need to like get wires glitched through the wall or like have to run wires all the way around your base until you find an opening it's not very nice so that's why i'm doing it like this design so now so post boom 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 flip it like this basically you just gotta make an eight if you want to follow my design you just got like to like make an eight pretty much boom it should line up perfectly if i got this all correct yep that's not an eight i made an h not an eight So then, I kind of forgot how an eight looks like. So I'm just gonna put that up in the chat. Yes, I'm that bad at numbers that I forgot what an eight looks like. I want like the seven segment type eight. Whatever, I get the idea. I might need to go pull up a seven segment clock. I'm that bad at this. See, I just have to do this. Okay, boom. Now I have a lot of units. So I have six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, nine units. Well, that's kind of obvious because nine things. Anyways. Um, if I had bought the perfect amount of green wires, that'll be awesome. I think I have some excess green wire on my base anyway, so if I didn't, it'd still be quite, it'd still be kind of fine. Okay. And uh, also, I'm talking about also the correct wiring for the AMPM signs. Yeah, I need it up to here. Even though the posts aren't lined up that good, um, it still needs to be that height. Boom. Boom, boom. You know, if I can actually, like, if that actually successfully, like, I get it. And that will be awesome. But if I, I have to go grab more off camera, that's fine. But I'm pretty sure that'll it kind of gets the idea rolling, sort of, if you know what I mean. Like you can kind of understand what I'm trying, what I'm where I'm trying to get at. Yeah. Sorry yeah, if I'm so not talking. I'm, one, two, I'm helping three. my friend set up one of the, I'm helping my friend <coughs> set up his friend's Discord server. So. I I have three. I need three more to complete these um the segments for the um for the um the other digit, and I have eight wires. I have nine wires. So that means I have to get the AM and PM wires. I could just use white wires, um because I have them. But hey, the green like sort of adds characteristic. Actually, I'll just use the white. It kind of makes it look better. Um, for what the number? Yeah, for the for the thing. It sort of it sort of draws a contract from the um from the time. I have one of your green. I know. Um, I need two. But that's fine, you can keep the green wire. I'll just take the whites. Cause then they like glow more, so it draws like a lot more attention to the um to my little thing. Well, I think it's time to dismantle this basically like proof of concept bleh. Proof of concept showing that I actually can do the this type of clock design. 
I'll actually hook up the AMP. Yeah, I, I can't hear you at all. No. I can hear you sometimes. I can hear you the time that you said I'm not talking as much, but I can't hear you anywhere else. I can't hear I haven't he heard you say anything else. Whatever. Okay, you just left and just probably now rejoining. Okay. Yay. It did, oh. that, it did that thing again where it mutes everybody myself. It's really stupid. Oof. Well, I guess that's just an oof. Yeah, I got you a green wire. Okay, thanks. You got me a green? Yeah. I and need to. Why not to... use the green wires off of this TAC V sign? Uh, I like the TAC V sign because then, like, um. You yeah. can use a different color for the K for Caitlyn's. That's actually a good idea. I don't have any. I don't have any purple wires, though. I have one. Okay. I'm gonna um, replace the K with a green. green, and you and you um and you have one for me, right? Yeah. And that just kind of ruins the T A, T and I. No, just uh, just take off the A and the V. I'm keeping the um. I took off the. Um, I took off the K for a pink or a pink wire. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put up a stub for each little little. You know, if you have like a wall built up like this, it's like so much of a pain to get this um, get up like this. That's why I'm building this clock before I've like completed the wall. And by the way, nobody can jump up here, which is nice. Okay, let me grab a different one. Yeah, I have a taller one, okay. More like there is a taller one, but yeah. So I'm gonna set up the P and the A today, hopefully. Um, well, I won't actually um, show me setting it up because it takes a little bit, but yeah. So, so P. And Hold on a second. A. Alright, can you hear me again? Yeah, I can hear you. Alright. Okay, so... Um, it actually isn't too hard, especially when you've gotten the coordinates of the clock timers on this. When, especially when you've more like got the already like areas of the clock timer. But it's not too hard if you're setting it up. So... Just I, if I were you, I would make sure that um, the signal output is at the bottom, and also all the logic is going right here. I would put the logic really near, so you don't need to use as many wires to build your clock. Remember, this is this tutorial will only make the AM and PM sign light up at this moment, but you also have the foundations of a clock. But stay tuned to Wednesday, where, today, where on that day, we're gonna get the one lighting up. And then Friday, we're, it's gonna take a while, but we're gonna get the, um, we're gonna get the, um, we're gonna finish the clock on Friday. It's gonna get, we're gonna get the, um, the rest of this set up. I'm 
Imagine me, imagine somebody coming by and just knocking over this pillar under the blueprints. Oh like my this. god. Oh my god. I'm glad I'm in a VIP server, that's what I gotta say. There's a daisy ball, I wonder if I'll win something. I'm gonna ch what make this a. Uh, you won. You win. You win this piece. You win this piece of wood. And this. This was in. No, the this was. No, it wasn't. Yeah, it was I'm a. Gl it was in there. No, I it wasn't. Give, no, give me. You didn't even pay for it. Fine, I'll pay three k. But I did win that. I won it. Okay, fine. Take it. Whatever. It's glitched in the floor, so you have to get it out. If you really want okay. it so bad. Just, you, you deal with it. Um. Anyways. All the weird n mumbling aside. Um. I got it. It's so, I gotta like turn, I'm gonna turn up your volume real quick, so you don't need At to talk loud. At least make a lever on this side of the door system, that I can open these doors with. Because I really don't want to have to go all the way over there for Let me do this, okay. For now, until I get one of these side, until I get one of the, until I get one uh, laser on each side, now the, the doors will always be open. But I'm, maybe, I'm gonna be playing on VIP anyway, so it doesn't really matter too much. Okay, well thank you for the blue wood because I needed some for my bin anyway. Nice. And the yellow wood, uh, where did you put that? Yellow wood, I just put it like right near the prize bin. Over. I put it like, it's near the um, phantom wood that's also by it. It's like right next to it. That's the wood that you actually think got. The one, one you actually, whatever. So this is the AM. So what I'm going to do now is I want to do this once like everything's all, f before everything's filled. So like if there's a problem with the blueprints, it's n not going to be too big of a deal. Nice. Okay, so the A needs to be like a lot less dense like that. Like it needs to be a lot easier to read. We're still recording, right? Yeah, I'm still recording. Okay. I might only get the A done because this is going to take a little bit. You got it. Okay, so what I'm probably going to do is I am going to, once I get the A working, I'm gonna pause, make sure the P works. And then once I've gotten that done, um, I'll come back and show you. The P is basically the exact same thing. Just get it lit up like I did with the A. I guess that's fine. It doesn't need to look amazing. It's just, it's, it's, you can see that it's an A. And the P, you can kind of see that it's not a, that the P isn't lit up. Anyways, I will be right back, guys, with the, with, um, the font, with, yeah, with what P, what to do with P. Okay, everybody, I've just hooked up the P. Um, something to keep in mind, whichever letter you have higher up, um, whichever letter you have higher up, you're going to need two wires because it just won't hit it unless you move the one that has a higher up closer to the letters. Um, also, looking at fr it from afar, it's a bit harder to see the um, the letter, the wires there. So if you're worried about wires, I wouldn't address that as a concern. So, yeah. Anyways. So, it's about to change over to P soon. 
I'll cut back again when we're getting very, very close. Like, a few seconds away. So I'll cut back. Okay, guys, we are getting really close. Um, Trimpire has a set, has to be first, has to go off for a second. So what should happen is the AM and the A should be, it should be off, all of them, both of them should be off for like a split second. And then it moves on to the, and then the P turns on. Or it's the same way around for P going to A. So, uh, you can also add an M in there. I just like putting P and A, because it looks a lot cleaner. Okay. It's a lot harder to see, but you can. Um, I'm pretty sure you guys can see. And then, just wait a second. The A turns on. Okay, don't follow my advice. Um, make sure the P thing, the P sign, is um, they're both merging with each other. I need to fix that real quickly. It should just turn on in a second, but don't do that because then it is like another lumber hour or something. Yeah, another lumber hour for that to turn to P. Um. And we don't want that, obviously, so. Yeah. Okay. So, again. So, just bring the on time. Grab on time. Bring it all the way to here. So, then, yeah. That's, then it's like that. So. Yeah, that's basically it. We have, so in the area, so first, just to finish off this video, I'm gonna fill up all the blueprints. Um, but actually that's not needed. You guys do, you can, guys can do that yourself. The blueprints will be all filled in the next video. Anyways, um, thank you so much for watching this video. If you did, smash that like button, subscribe, click the bell icon, which should turn on all post notifications. See this little animation here? Uh, not this one. See this little animation here? That should exact be exactly what happens if you decide to subscribe and hit the bell. That little bell thing, a little shake, it sh does a little shaky shaky on my animation. Um, it sends you notifications whenever I go live, or I, um, or I upload to a uh, depend um, and all. So yeah, and liking is helpful a lot. And yeah, I will see you all in the next video or live stream, depending on what you watch from me. Bye everyone.